Welcome to the evening episode of Toothy Trivia. I'm your host, Emma, and I hope you had an awesome day. Go ahead and get your toothbrush ready. Now it's time to make brushing your teeth for two minutes fun and easy. Are you ready? Let's go! Today's trivia theme is spring. Holidays that occur in spring include Easter, Passover, April Fool's Day, Earth Day, Arbor Day, Mother's Day, Father's Day, Cinco de Mayo, and the Festival of Colors in India. One long-term study found that at least in the Colorado Rocky Mountain region, spring begins on average about three weeks earlier than it did in the 1970s. If Earth rotated on an axis perpendicular to the plane of its orbit around the Sun, rather than on a 23.4 degree tilt, there would be no variation in day lengths and no variation in seasons. Easter always falls on the first Sunday after the first full moon after the spring equinox. There is a growing movement to call the spring equinox the March equinox or northward equinox, to avoid northern hemisphere bias. In the southern hemisphere, springtime lasts from August until November. While some people prefer not to feed birds in spring and summer, during the spring migration, a feeder might be a useful source of food for traveling birds. In China, the coming of spring coincides with celebrations for the Chinese New Year. The holiday falls on the first day of the first lunar month, in January or February. For the Japanese, the opening of the cherry blossom, Japan's national flower, in March or April signals the start of spring. During the spring, birds are more vocal as they sing to attract mates and warn away rifles. While December is the most popular time to get engaged, late spring and fall are the most popular months to get married. According to the National Association of Realtors, spring is the most popular season to sell or buy a house. Buyers are usually hesitant to move during the winter when the weather is colder and kids are in school. So, while there are lots of houses to choose from in the spring, property prices are at their highest then. And you're done! Weren't those two minutes easy? If you like these episodes, be sure to tell your parents and dentists to subscribe to Toothy Trivia on iTunes, Google Play, or Stitcher. We can also be found as Toothy Trivia on Facebook, Twitter, and Instagram.